Hey guys, my name's Chris, and you're watching WC Fishing. Feel and drive. <laughs> what is going on guys Chris here back again with another video for you all today so as you guys can see we're another day here at Boston College and uh yeah basically we have something pretty special today planned we have Eddie with us today you want to introduce yourself to the camera real quick uh, hey guys I'm Eddie I'm a Boston College class of 2024 uh, student I'm here with Chris he's gonna teach me how to fish so excited Exactly. So as you guys can see, we're doing something pretty special. This is the first time I've ever done this on my channel. Other guys do this all the time. But basically, I'm going to be teaching Eddie how to catch a fish. Now, he's caught a couple in the past, but basically, uh, it's, it's going to be a, a brand new experience. I'm trying to show him all the bases of freshwater fishing. We're also not going to the Chestnut Hill Reservoir. We're going to be going down to the Hammond Pond Reservation, which is nearby. Yeah, but basically, guys, it's going to be a lot of fun. But before we start the video, guys, about 79% of you guys are not subscribed. Uh, make sure to hit the red subscribe button and smash the notification bell. And let's get fished. All right, guys, so as you can see, you made it to the spot. Definitely not as bad as I thought it was going to be. I have the trout magnet tied out right now. I'm probably going to switch it off to like a wacky rig or something. Hopefully, I got some soft plastics in my bag. Let's see what we can do. Let's get some fish. Got a little bit of bread on this hook. I'm just going to throw it out there. Hopefully, we get on something right there. Instant bite, instant fish. Little bluegill sunfish. All right. That's how it's done. That's crazy. Little bluegill sunfish. Not obviously what we're going for. I was going for bass. I decided to throw in some bread just to make sure we got the skunk out of the way. Very easy way to catch fish. Just a bluegill on a piece of bread. Okay. How you doing, everyone? So Eddie's got the uh, <laughs> here. So Eddie, see what we're gonna do? We are just gonna dip it in the water right over there. Over there. What? This 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 is so simple. It's great fishing right here. There you go, guys. Little. What a Yo, I, I literally did nothing. <laughs> you guys can see Eddie got on his very, very first sunfish. Uh, yeah, awesome little guy. Bluegill, obviously nothing crazy. So we'll try to get on something a little bigger than that, as you guys can tell. Okay, Andy, are you ready? I'm ready. So fish right there. Three, two. Yeah, Wow, two go. seconds! Look at this! See, BC, BC College should be learning to catfish in two seconds. Okay, right. Look at this, look at this, look at this. Little, little bluegill sunfish right there. All right, Man, it's so easy. Like, I'm a fishing pro. Before we switch over to try to catch some bass, I saw a school of golden shiners in the water. I have never caught a golden shiner. I really want to try to catch one while we're here, while we have the opportunity. I'm going to go and try to catch one on a piece of bread. Let's see what we can do. Ourselves, a little bit of bread. And we're going to go ahead and try to catch one of these shiners. There's a school of them right over here well that's a bluegill that's not what we're trying to do all right bud don't care about bluegill i want that shiner like that's a school of golden shiners right there folks what we got yes golden shiner i knew it right, hold up bud stop that he's right here let's go guys look at this thing let's go that's a new species right there boys freaky species in boston that is pretty insane awesome awesome fish i mean like look how beautiful that is. okay sorry bud uh anyway but awesome, awesome guys. Let's go get a release on this fish. What is going on guys? So it is actually a couple of days later. Uh, yeah, I wanted to make sure we catch at least some decent fish in this video. So as you guys can see, we are here at the Charles River in Boston. As you can see, we have Eddie here again. We're gonna try to get him on a different fish than a sunfish. We wanna get him something a little bigger. And we also got uh, a new BC student here. We got David. Do you want to introduce yourself to the uh, camera? Yeah, I'm David. I'm a junior at BC. First time fishing. <laughs> yep, first time fishing. See, uh, almost like it. it had a little more experience. Let's go and see what we can catch. All right, guys, you can see got a little trout magnet tied on. I'm just gonna go ahead and uh, yeah, just jig it around the structure. Honestly, I don't really know much about the Charles in terms of uh, you know what species, brackish, freshwater, best things to use in here. Oh, got him, got him. What do we got here? Large mouth bass. Let's go. Oh, sorry, camera and fish. All right, guys, as you can see, there we have it, largemouth bass. See, Eddie, David, you guys are going to catch a couple of these today. That's going to be the main goal. Uh, I'll say about a pound. Good fish. Let's go get a release on our catch. All right, so as you guys can see, we switched up tactics a little bit. Got some bait, and we have our uh, Sedona out here. Rigged up a catfish rig, casted it out there. And yeah, we're going to see what we can catch. I don't know if we're going to catch a catfish, guys. Let's go and see what we can catch. A few moments later. Yep, yeah, that's a fish. Oh, bring it in, bring it in. Oh, yeah, David. All right, David's got a fish on here, guys. I do believe, yep, we got ourselves on a white perch right here. All right, David, 
this is your very first white perch. Pretty insane little catch using some uh, bluegill that we caught. Awesome, awesome fish. Go ahead and drop him down there where he belongs. Woo! Woo! Nice job, man. That was pretty awesome. <laughs> All right, guys. Eddie finally got on the <laughs> Maybe. Uh. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. All right, all right, Eddie. Bring it in. Wow. Let's see what it is. See what we got. I'm, I'm curious. I'm curious. Okay. Oh, it's bigger. Bigger white perch. All right, bring them back up. Bring them up. Bring them up. Here we go, guys. Check that thing out. Better size white perch. Wow. Beautiful little white perch off the Charles River. Yeah, right I feel like here. fishing is getting natural to me. He's a natural, a born like natural. I've been doing this my see. whole life. See, this is <laughs> Eddie has found this to be his calling. Well, awesome fish. Let's go and get a release. All right, guys. My turn. Go see what we can catch. The action here is ridiculous. Like people don't really talk about the trawls that much, but I mean, honestly, it's pretty insane how fast we're getting these fish. That like, we're already on, we're already on a fish. Did you just see that? We see how fast that bite, that bite was instantaneous. There we go. Got something this time. And there we go, another white perch. Uh, my second fish of the day. Awesome little white perch here. Beautiful, beautiful fish. Uh, yeah, smallest one of all the bunch, so technically you guys are all ahead of me here. Let's go and get a release. All right, guys. Okay. Finally, Ooh. he's got another one. Oh, oh, it's so... Oh, 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 giant fish. So hard. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> What's on it? Is it a shark? Oh, it's a blue whale. <laughs> <laughs> guys, blue whale. First time ever in the Charles River. That also looks exactly like a white perch. <laughs> Hopefully he's still there. There he is. There we go, we got another one. Still kind of small. <laughs> there you go, David. Second white perch right there. Awesome, awesome catch. How does it make you feel? Second one? Very happy. Very happy, all right. I'm proud of him. Let's go get a release. All right, guys. Well, uh, fished here for about two and a half hours, and uh, yeah, I'd say we did pretty good. Caught uh, one bluegill, watchmouth bass, and like how many yellow per or white perch? I, I don't even know at this point. It doesn't really matter. We caught fish. How do you guys feel about the experience? It's a good first time experience. Learned a lot and looking forward to more. Yeah, it was great. It was fun. So if you guys enjoyed the content, make sure to hit the subscribe button and smash the notification button. Leave a like on the video as well. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Catch <laughs>